Georgia Tech scored more points tonight at McCamish Pavilion than they had in nine games. You have to go back to January 26th when they got 82 against Wake Forest. They got 78 tonight, so they were obviously efficient on the offensive end in their victory against the Maryland Terrapins. Tim Brando along with Corey Alexander. We witnessed it, and, uh, you know, Brandon Reed got the job done off the bench, and even though Georgia's hunt was taken away, at least early, you know, they didn't panic. And they got a lot of productivity, didn't they? It was the bench, and, of course, we talked with Coach Gregory early today, and he talked about how Maryland's bench may have an advantage. But it was his bench that really was the difference when you talk about Brandon Reed, Camion Hosey, and even Julian Royal getting involved in the mix. And that really is what propelled Georgia Tech to a win here this, tonight. Uh, for protecting the ball is always important uh, for both of these teams. And Maryland uh, did a poor job of it, again, in critical situations with a lot of points off turnovers. As we look at the highlights, though, it was quite a show for Brandon Reed when he came off the bench. King an eight nothing run when he got into the game and the left-hander was just hitting everything in sight. And not only was he knocking down shots, but he was getting out in transition and finishing. And of course, 10 points in the first half for Brandon Reed really sparked the Ramblin' Wreck. Maryland got some answers in transition and uh, wasn't that Alex Lynn played poorly. I thought he was pretty aggressive when he had to be. He just didn't have enough help. He didn't, but it was Reed who came in the second half knocking down four three-pointers. And also, we talked about Julian Royal made a contribution finishing at the rim. And it was really just the bench of Georgia Tech that propelled them yeah. over top of Maryland oh, yeah. tonight. Carter Jr. had 19, Reed with 17, Miller with 16 on 12 of, on 12, of 12 at the line. That was an outstanding performance for him, too. And the, the, the real key here, there were some late threes during garbage time for Maryland to help make it look a little better statistically, but they were down by four threes most of the game, and that was the difference in the outcome of the basketball game. And look at those assists for Georgia Tech. 22 assists they had on the night. And after the game, the star, Brandon Reed, spoke with Corey Alexander. All right, thanks. Here with Brandon Reed. Brandon, 17 points for you tonight. You came off, knocked down your first three, and you were off to the races after that. What was going through your mind tonight? Well, I just wanted to come out and be aggressive. Uh, I see we, we kind of had a slow start, so my mindset was to get in the game and, and try to help my team on offense and defense. And uh, turns out I was making my shots. My teammates was finding me. You know, I just want to thank God, man, because it was some days where – you know, I was down on myself, but, you know, they told me to keep playing, keep playing, and, and stay focused. So that's what I did, and it, and it paid off for us tonight. And you talk about being down on yourself. Of course, a new role for you coming off the bench compared to being the starting lineup. It takes some adjusting to get into. But, however, Coach Gregory has been happy with your progress. Yeah, I mean, it, it, it was pretty tough at first, you know. Uh, I used to playing, you know, it was an adjustment period. But, you know, uh, you know, I stayed positive about it. Just said, you know, as long as I'm still playing, you know, uh, being – Playing at the end of the game, we're just playing, just being there for my teammates, you know, that's, that's all that matters. Thanks a lot, Brandon. Great game this afternoon. Very unselfish performance by Brandon Reed, and Brian Gregory comes away with win number five in conference play. For Corey Alexander, this is Tim Brando. That was the story tonight in Atlanta, Georgia. 78-68, Georgia Tech the winner. If you attended the Maryland Georgia Tech game on February 27th and received an ACC Digital Network watch and win card, the winning number is 12018. Check out the ACC.com slash trophy tour for details about our next stop.